What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. So the Labrador Retriever has been confirmed as the second dog to be released in the Hunter Call of the Wild. This new dog DLC coming out in November it has been confirmed for November 28th will be the Labrador Retriever. So awesome. We're getting a retriever. I think most people probably wanted this next dog to be a retriever, something that could retrieve things like waterfowl, rabbit, small game, that sort of thing. This dog will also be able to uh, retrieve upland birds, which is super cool. So yeah, I'm stoked. I was was really hoping it would be a golden retriever but we got the labrador i was hoping for something fluffy but uh i don't know if we can really get the fluffy animals the fluffy dogs in the game so we get another short haired dog but it is a retriever so that's super cool and then just reading from the call of the wild website welcoming our newest family member the second dog to be released for the hunter call of the wild the labrador retriever isn't just adorable it's an intelligent versatile companion that empowers you to hunt in an efficient new way being able to on command fetch any rabbit hare waterfowl or up land bird on land or in water now it says in water i don't think that means this guy will swim all the way out and grab ducks as they're floating in i think that just means like on the water's edge when they get up to the land when they're kind of just floating on the edge of the water the dog will be able to retrieve them and pick them up as well as if they're just over on land somewhere so i'm a little bit confused about something that it says here something i want to talk about let me know down in the comments what you guys think it does say that the lab will tirelessly pick up harvests around you by order of priority starting with the one you are aiming at in other words it allows you to continue searching for your next target without interruption so i think that means that i mean i'm hoping that means that the retriever will be able to pick up multiple animals kind of at once and maybe drop them by your side right and then go out and pick the next one um as far as the aiming at thing i don't really understand i guess whatever direction you're pointing your gun in or whatever direction you're looking in the retriever will prioritize there and go from there I guess it says that you can continue hunting and it will go out and just pick up animals as you're still hunting. So I'm a little bit confused because if I'm still hunting, I'm aiming at whatever I'm hunting. I'm not aiming at whatever's dead on the ground. So I'm hoping that that means that the lab will go out. You know, if I've got 10 ducks down, I'm hoping this thing will be able to go out, pick one up, come back, drop it by my side and go out and pick up another one without me really doing anything, you know, with uh, just being able to still continue doing my hunt. And then when I'm ready, I can look over and pick up the animals, harvest them one by one that the dog has brought over. Hopefully it won't just go out, pick one up, and then you gotta harvest it and then send it back out. And then it picks that one up, brings it back, and then you gotta send it back out. Hopefully that's not how that works. I've never hunted with the dogs in the Hunter Classic, so I'm not entirely sure what it's like in Classic. Maybe you guys can let me know down below. I imagine it'll be something similar to that. Like the Bloodhound, you can grow your connection to your lab by petting it, giving it treats, or playing with it. In turn, as you get to know each other and hunt more often, its efficiency will improve over time. So I kind of wonder what that means too this dog is only retrieving so I don't know if that means that maybe it won't be very good at retrieving at first and as you get better and level up your dog it will get better at retrieving I'm not really sure how that's going to work exactly maybe it just gets faster at retrieving animals as you level it up um, but we'll see how that works uh, on the 28th so yeah you'll be able to name the dog right choose its fur coat variation just like the bloodhound and assign traits that match your hunting style you can also add multiple dogs to your roster making it easy to pick which one to hunt with it is available as both male and female in seven unique fur coat variations black yellow chocolate silver charcoal fox red and champagne so that's super cool i'm pretty sure i'm gonna do a black lab and go with the charcoal but we'll see what the other ones look like pretty cool that there's seven variations that's really cool i was really hoping that with this dlc we'd be able to have more than one dog out with us at a time i think it'd be so awesome to be able to have one retriever and one bloodhound in case we need to track any blood it'd be so cool to be able to bind to two different keys the wheel right for each dog and be able to command them one at a time separately maybe that will come sometime in the future but it would have been really really cool to have uh, multiple dogs i was really open for that but maybe we'll get that sometime down the line so yeah this is coming november 28th obviously you know there's going to be probably some early access for us content creators super excited about that i'll keep you guys posted as i find out more and i believe ew is going to be doing a first look stream on november the 16th so we'll get a first look at this thing the 16th of november that's only two days away, you guys. That's this Thursday. So pretty cool. We're getting a retriever. What do you guys think? Let me know down below. Are you stoked? Is this what you were hoping for? If you enjoyed the video, please do drop a like. It helps a ton. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done that. And as always, you guys, I will see you in the next one.